morning and um, welcome back to the diary um, another day fishing for the tench today um, those of you that um, follow the diary may well have seen my uh, very special day on this club lake and I got 11 tench and a new PB um, well on that day all of the fish uh, came to the feeder of one form or another um, and it just occurred to me that it might be fun to um, see if I can get one on a waggler um, fishing the old lift method <laughs> this is this is something I've not done for years and years so I thought well it's got to be worth a try um, and the rewards could be quite quite nice I mean we've all, we've, we already know there's some lovely tension here so today tench fishing on the waggler um, at the moment, bright sun, clear skies, and quite a strong breeze, but I am sheltered in this swim. And um, needless to say, the, uh, this is the swim where I caught my tench the last time I was here. <laughs> First fish on. <laughs> I'm not sure what it is but it pull in so it might be the tench <laughs> a bream <laughs> and it's a foul hooked bream which is disappointing well that's the first hour and a half And just the one on the fairly hooked bream. Um, hook baits, well, at the moment, three um, red maggots. Although I do have the option of swapping over to corn hook bait, which, uh, which I'll probably do um, do shortly. Plenty of time yet, though. This may be another bream.
whatever it is he's hanging on. Change my mind about bream. seen it. Oh, no. 
tis a tench when it's hooked in the tail. is a great shame because that is a lovely tench that will almost certainly have been another new PB if it had been hooked in the mouth <clears throat> that is a huge tench Unfortunately, not fairly, not fairly caught. But just look at this. Look at that. Isn't that fantastic? As I say, that would almost certainly have been a new PB. It's well recovered, I think. <laughs> well, that one was a classic lift bite. So, hopefully. It'll be hooked in the right place. <laughs> what have we got? Oh, oh it's a lovely tench. <laughs> it's another big, big tench. Now. And then it had other other ideas. Yes, 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 yes. <laughs> oh <my God. laughs> Six pounds, ten ounces. Well, we finally hooked one properly, and a lovely, lovely fish at that. They don't half hang on these things. <laughs> Took a long time to get started, but now it seems to be happening. There's something of an audience here. Well, 
that certainly wasn't the classic lift bike that just took off. Well, we've got about an hour to go. Um, three nice tench. Conditions conditions have changed and improved a bit. The sun um, the sun's nowhere near as strong, although it's just coming back out again now. Um, it's clouded over a good bit, and the strong breeze this morning has eased off a, a bit as well. In fact, it's gone quite humid. Um, so it's time for another one yet, I think. And I said there was time for another one. This is, isn't a tench though. This looks like a bit of a slab. Covered in spawning tubicles. Like I say, nice bream. Bream moved in, and they have. Oh Can't complain about that, really, can you? Lovely condition though, nice fish. So that's three of each, three tench, and, um, and now three bream. And then now it's time to go home. That's it for the day. Good day though. It was very slow to start, but once it got going, three nice tench and three nice bream. And a rather strange episode with a huge tench hooked in the tail. Um, when you fish with feeder rigs, bolt rigs in effect, um, Yep, the chances of foul hooking fish are pretty slim. Of course with a waggler, slightly different. Um, I suspect the bream I got first thing this morning and then the big tench were a function of the fisher with the waggler. Um, I daren't tell you what was going through my mind while I was playing that tench. It just felt enormous, whatever it was. And of course when you're hooked in the tail, they really do have the advantage. Anyway, that's it. Good day. I've enjoyed it. Hope you did too. Uh, what's next? Well, carp fishing probably. I'm desperate to catch my first carp of the summer. So, um, yeah, we'll be fishing for carp somewhere, I think. I uh, hope you enjoyed this one. Thanks for watching. Thanks for sticking with me if you're still there. And uh, I'll see you soon. Bye for now.